Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video I'm going to be showing you everything that we got in our weekly food shop. This week we decided to go to Morrison's because everywhere else I couldn't get a delivery slot so Morrison's was our only option. Although I am pretty happy with it because the prices were actually a lot more affordable than I thought they would be. I expected Morrison's to be on the more expensive side like Sainsbury's because I find Sainsbury's really expensive. But actually it was quite affordable so I'm happy with that. I will leave the meal plan in the description. Everything in our food shop is in the everything that we're having with our meals. We do have things already in the house that I wanted to use instead of getting more of the exact same thing we've already got. So I did treat us to a few little more treats in this food shop than I usually would because we do have quite a bit of food in in terms of what can go with our meals and things. So please don't think this is all crap that we're eating. This is just little treats that I've got because we do already have food in. I like to already use what we've got in as well as get all the stuff that we need. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you the food shop. So this is our Morrison's food shop. It is a little bit all over the place, so I hope you don't mind that, but I didn't really have room for everything. So here it is, let's start over here. So I had to put things on the kettle and all sorts because I didn't have room. So we got some blueberry muffins. These are perfect for the kids. Like Cole really, really enjoys the blueberry muffins. I can scan the mini ones, but they didn't have any. So I just thought I'd rather get these than not get any all. And then I got the cheese straws. This is one of the bonuses of ordering from Morrison's. Everywhere I order from, we don't have a proper bakery. And I love Morrison's Bakery cheese straws. So these need to be eaten by the end of tomorrow. So definitely going to enjoy those. Then we got some strawberry milk. Just something different for the kids to have. Apples oranges that my child has already gone into because he couldn't wait <laughs> and then another thing we got is a mandarin trifle honestly looks amazing and this has also got to be eaten as well it's a use by so preferably today really that that's got to be eaten so i'll probably have that after dinner and then we've got a pizza this is actually best before tomorrow so we're probably gonna have to eat this either tonight we have had pizza today so i don't know what we're gonna do we might freeze it and then have it another day i'll see what we can do with it but yeah we've got a ham and mushroom pizza i've just got an obsession with mushrooms anything with mushrooms i want it so we got that pizza then just got six eggs just for breakfast and that kind of thing a gammon joint we're gonna have this in the slow cooker you put it in for six hours wrapped in foil and it falls apart and it's really yummy I then got some cooked beef for sandwiches. Yes, this was only a pound, but trust me, this is actually really nice. I've tried Aldi's version as well, and that's really nice. Surprising how cheap it is as well, so don't knock it till you try it, guys. We've got some lettuce. We're going to be having burgers. Don't know what night. I'm going to have to check dates and things, but we're going to have that on some chicken burgers, some strawberries, essential for Arbor. She's the biggest fan ever of strawberries. Then some chili con carne. We're going to have this on hot dogs. I really am loving the idea of loaded hot dogs at the minute, so... That's what we're going to have on hot dogs. Don't know if it's going to be very nice, but we'll give it a go. Then got some cheese and onion sausage rolls. Don't really ever get these, but I thought I'd have a change. Then got some chicken tikka masala. We're going to have this with some rice and naan bread one night. Some spaghetti because actually I don't know what we're having this for. I don't know. You'll see in the meal plan, but yeah, spaghetti for whatever reason I decided we was having that for. Tango cheese Doritos. Originally, I was going to get some chili heat wave, but they didn't have any, so we just went with tango cheese. Better than none when I really fancy some Doritos. I then got some. Oh, this reminds me. This is what it's for. So it's for meatballs. That's what the pasta is for. So that's the sauce. Then we just got some Morrison's own cheese puffs. Aubrey is a really big fan of cheese puffs, thanks to my mum. So I just thought I'd get her a pack of those, and Cole can have some if he wants. He's not the biggest fan of crisps, but he can have some if he fancies some crisps one night. Then we've got some Oreos. Cole absolutely loves Oreos, so I'm surprised he hasn't seen these and tucked in already. And then we got two packs of cobs. These are for the hot dogs, and these are just the burger buns for the burgers. Then got some ice cream cones. We've got a big box of ice cream in the freezer. And no cones, so we needed to make use of them, so we've got some cones. Then got some porridge. I really enjoy porridge, and so does Cole, so that is what we're going to have one morning. And then also introduce Aubrey to it. She's only had the baby one, so... She'll probably like this. It's probably not going to be much different to what she's had before. 
And then we've got some milk chocolate. I got this one because I wanted to make the kids some waffles with some melted chocolate and strawberries. Kind of like a little dessert bar. So that's what that's for. And then we also got the kids some little chocolate bars. These were originally meant to be Paw Patrol ones. But I'm guessing they didn't have them in stock. So they just picked another one for us. And we're very happy with that. Cole enjoys those anyway. Got some Ritz crackers. I had the idea that I was going to make them some cheese and crackers for a lunch one day. So that's what these are for. Oh then a whole lot of um carbs and things got the waffles like i said we're going to use those for either breakfast and also for the dessert i have in mind for the kids then we got some nan breads these are just the plain ones and then i just got a loaf of bread and then i got some bagels this is the cinnamon and raisin these are really good for breakfast in the morning aubrey's never tried them but they are really nice so hopefully she'll enjoy these then onto the frozen section we don't have too much but we do have a little bit so we've got some hash browns we love hash browns in this house we're gonna be having breakfast wraps i don't know why i'm telling you this because the meal plan's gonna be in the description but anyway that's what we've got hash browns for and also if we want a fry up or anything during the week we do love a fry up in this house then we've got some meatballs. I was going to get the fresh ones, but these are really good. These taste like Ikea meatballs. So if you are not try them and you like Ikea meatballs, get these ones. They're really yummy. Then we've got some instant mash. If you've watched me before, you will know that I do prefer this one. Kind of maybe a little bit of a lazy thing, but I do enjoy this. Um, instead of making my own, I'm not the best at making mash. So just got that one. Really convenient as well. Then got some burgers for obviously the chicken burgers we're going to be having pack of veg another pack of veg this is corn on the cob and then the last thing we got is some orange and pineapple juice and that is everything that we got this week from morrison's very impressed with our first shop and especially the bakery things we're gonna tuck in if you guys did enjoy today's video please smash a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i'd be extremely grateful and if you haven't already please get a notification bell notified every single time i upload a video and i will see you in my next video